producers of HBO's television series Silicon Valley, approached Tsaiki Weissman, a professor at Stanford, and Vineeth Mishra, a graduate student for developing an efficiency metric for lossless compression. Professor Tsaiki developed an amazing equation that compared both time required to compress a file and its compression ratio. He termed that equation as, Weissman score after his own name. The Weissman score, W is formulated as alpha times the ratio of compression ratio of a particular file and the compression ratio of a universal standard compression ratio for that file times the ratio of log of time taken by the standard universal compression algorithm to compress a particular file and that of our compression algorithm. Where alpha is a scaling constant. By normalizing by the performance of a standard compressor, we take away variation in compressive performance between types of data. Which means that Weissman score remains the same whether your algorithm is compressing a text or an image or an audio file. According to Wikipedia, Weissman score is only for fictional use. It cannot be used in real-world compression algorithms as the unit used to measure the times changes the score, meaning if one person measures time in seconds and other one in minutes, let's say 120 seconds and 2 minutes, they both refers to same amount of time. But Weissman score used log function of time, in that sense, log of 120 is not equal to log of 2. Also, the time taken by the algorithm should not be equal to 1 as log of 1 is 0 which will yield the Weissman score 0. If you have any question ask it in the comments, I'll try to answer if it is really important. Also leave a like and you found your answer and don't forget to subscribe. I am Dan Sirsaji and you are watching Data Compression 101.